Monica Galetti's squid dish left MasterChef The Professionals fans unimpressed on Monday night's episode. The latest installment of the BBC show saw four more chefs try to impress the judges with their skills in the kitchen. First off, the contestants had to complete a skills test set by Monica where she asked them to make some squid croquettes. But those watching at home said they thought the dish didn't look too appealing, even when it was cooked by her as an example at the start. Some even claimed that the other two judges, Greg Wallace and Marcus Waring, should have told her it wasn't a good dish. One said, squid. No thanks, I don't care how it is cooked, even by Monica. Disgusting old stuff. Hashtag MasterChef the professionals, hashtag MasterChef. Another wrote, if only Greg had turned round and said actually Monica. It's not very good. That would make brilliant TV. A third pinned, hashtag MasterChef wonder does Marcus ever want to really critique Monica? He's bound to think sometimes I can do that better at Marcus Waring. Head chef Simon, 36, was the first to take on the challenge, but things ended up going wrong. As Judge Marcus cut into the croquette, he said, the squid is raw. Monica added, you made the bechamel, you made the croquettes, they're lovely and crispy. But the mix, it's not edible. You knew the squid needed to be cooked before it went into the bechamel, but you weren't sure how to do it. The judges weren't the only ones who pointed out the mistake and took to X to share their views. One said on the social media platform, raw squid time, hashtag MasterChef the professionals. Another wrote, no Simon, not raw squid, hashtag MasterChef the professionals. A third penned, whoops, hashtag MasterChef the professionals. It comes after Judge Monica revealed the reason for her return to show as the new series kicked off last month. The chef, 46, announced her decision to leave her role as a judge on the BBC show last year to focus on her family after her then 15-year-old nephew was diagnosed with cancer. But now she is back and has explained on the The Midpoint podcast what led her to returning to the popular cooking series. She said, I saw a therapist. I've never done that before. I've never had so many things happening at the same time. I needed to reach out to outside help, someone just to talk to with everything. That was one of the best things I did. I feel more energetic, more excited to be back in it this year having had that time out.